One, two, three. Go. Hello and welcome again to English State YouTube channel. This is Sam again and you are here to learn English language. So if you are new here for the first time, consider subscribing and don't forget to smash up that like button. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a singular noun into plural noun. It might be easy for you, but hey, there are some important tricks that you have to know. Stay tuned. I think it's super easy to make a singular noun into a plural noun in English language. It seems like a piece of cake because we just add s in the last of the noun. For example, a word becomes words. A car becomes cars and a house becomes houses. As you see here, we just add S in the last of the word. But there are a bunch of words in English language, we want to make them into a plural form. Some of them change completely, others doesn't change at all, and some others need to remove, for example, Y and add IES. So that's why this lesson is very important and let's see some examples now. So here we go. Men becomes men. Men in singular, men in plural. Women in singular becomes women, women. Child, one child, two children. One person, people. One tooth, two teeth. One foot, two feet. So these words don't change. Fish stay fish, deer stay deer, sheep stay also sheep. Also we have wife becomes wives in plural. Knife becomes knives. Okay, you see here? Let's move to other words. Some words end with O in the last, like tomato and hero. So what we do if we want to make these words into plural form? We have to put E before S. It becomes tomatoes, heroes like this. The next one mouse, two mice. Mouse, mice. And now you have to be attention because we have just like similar ending. We have two words, both of them end with Y, both of them are in singular form. So what we do if you want to make them into plural form? If we want to make them into plural form, we have to look before Y, okay? So we will find that activity ends with Y and before that Y we have consonant letter. It's not the same as here, okay? Day ends with Y, before it we have vowel letter. So in this case I have to remove Y and add IES. But in this case I will just add S. So activities, days. Remember, if we find that before Y we have consonant letter, we have to remove that Y and add IES. If we look here and find that before Y we have vowel, we just make sure that we put one S. No problem in this case. Okay guys, I just gave you some examples. I know that there are some words I didn't mention, but I will put them in the description box below. Make sure you check them out. I hope you guys like this video and you find it beneficial to you. If so, hit that thumbs up now, share it with your friends and if you're new here, consider subscribing for more videos. This is Sam from English State, see you tomorrow.